grab it at the end. Now you make the mitt opposite because you have to tuck it around your thumb like this so that you can clean around the catheter. You work under the thigh, edge of soap, rub it in. You go around the catheter and you open up these two fingers. You go down the catheter tubing. Then you take your pinky finger and you go down the middle. Turn the washcloth around. Then you're gonna wash the labias, just like that. You can use this hand to pretend like you're holding open the lips, but then you're gonna rinse the same way. Normally, you do it opposite, so when you make a regular mitt, it looks like this. When you're making this mitt, you're doing it towards the pinky and folding it towards the thumb. So when you tuck it in, put your gloves on, you pull that piece out so you have that room to clean around the catheter like this. And you go down the tubing about three to four inches, pinky, turn it around. fingers, only two fingers, pull the towel out. All right, Mrs. Chase, I'm going to turn you on your side. Cross your arms. One, two, three. Come back over. your arms and your legs and on the count of three. One, two, three. This goes in the garbage. <coughs> this goes in your hamper. This gets rinsed and dumped. Dry. This goes in the garbage. Get the towel. Remove your gloves, wash your hands. Okay, Mrs. Chase, I'm going to straighten the sheets and adjust your pillow. Are you comfortable? Do you need anything? Pull back the screen. Lower your bed. Here is your call light. Don't hesitate to ring. Now, always make sure you place the call light in your hand, even if it's a mannequin. Wash my hands. I'm done.